Madam Chair, you gave an excellent uh, presentation of Mr. Whitaker's experience, but you left out one very important fact. He's my neighbor, lives, lives down the dirt road. Uh, you go down Bragg Hill and up over Little Dinsmore Hill and take a little left, and there they are on the same dirt road right down, right down the street in Vermont. So it's wonderful to have Michael here, Mary and Joe. Uh, you did outline his public experience, his private experience, and uh, I was going to do that, but you've done it so well that I don't think we need to add to it. But I do want to say a couple of things. Uh, with this extraordinary experience, he has first as a pilot, a light, lifelong pilot, uh, and with that, a constant concern about safety uh, because he have people he he's had people he loves in his own plane. With his experience at the FAA, where you have this huge, uh, important agency, and he had the responsibility to make it work in the implementation of a very important program that you mentioned. And then with his experience in the private sector uh, with United Airlines and the very responsible big jobs he had there, how can you have more experience uh, in every phase of what's required to have our flight systems be safe, to have performance be solid, and to have the managerial, exper managerial experience uh, to kind of create the team and the culture that's necessary for a well-functioning FAA. It's something that he and I spoke about at Dan & Witts, which is a store uh, where if you don't have it, you don't need it. That's the Norwich famous country store. So that broad depth of experience uh, in that decision, and this is what I also really appreciate. At a time in his life when he was doing fine, he lives on a nice place that Bragg Hill, anyone wants, anyone wants to come and see it, it's a nice place. He wanted to serve. And we so need that in this country, to have people with the benefit of a lifelong career in the public and private sector deciding, you know what, I want to serve. So that gives me just immense confidence that we're going to have a tremendous uh, director. And I yield back.